Welcome to WNJ. We are excited that you have chosen to have your baby at Wilson & Jones Regional Medical Center. And to make sure you are as prepared as possible, we would like to share some information and suggestions with you. Before that exciting day arrives, pre-admission paperwork and signatures should be completed by your 36th week of pregnancy at the registration desk in the front lobby of the hospital. Come by at your convenience during regular business hours. What to bring to the hospital for yourself and your baby? We suggest a small bag with personal items, going home clothes for you and your baby, and don't forget the car seat. Mothers will normally labor, deliver, and complete the postpartum all in the same private maternity suite. We have a family-oriented environment, so your family can be together during the birth process and postpartum. Most of our maternity rooms are equipped with a queen-size bed and family-friendly furnishings so that your family can all be comfortable after delivery. Support during labor is very important and our specialty trained uh, labor and delivery nurses are there to help with comfort measures, coping measures, and it's also important that you have your own coach and support person there. If your physician needs to deliver your baby by cesarean birth, the procedures will take place in an obstetrical operating room within the labor and delivery area. In most cases, your support person will be able to attend the birth. Here in Labor and Delivery, we do not have an age limit on our visitors, but we would ask that for the little ones that they have adult supervision other than the support or coach person. When the baby's delivered, we place them directly on your chest, dry them off, and then um, we place them skin to skin for at least an hour or until the baby's had its first breastfeeding. The benefits for this are that the heart rate is regulated, the respirations are regulated, the baby's temperature, and also blood sugars. This enhances bonding and breastfeeding, and it helps the uterus to contract, which causes less bleeding. The recovery of you and your baby will be checked routinely by your nurses. We encourage breastfeeding and have a certified lactation consultant on staff to help you with a successful breastfeeding experience, both in the hospital and after you go home. Research demonstrates the importance of breastfeeding within the first hour after delivery. Breastfeeding your baby can lower their risk of having asthma or allergies. They can have fewer ear infections, respiratory illnesses, and diarrhea. Breastfeeding has been linked to higher IQ scores in later childhood, decreased risk of diabetes, obesity, and childhood cancers. Mom benefits from breastfeeding too. When mom breastfeeds, it releases the hormone oxytocin, which may reduce uterine bleeding after birth. It can also lower the risk of breast and ovarian cancers, lowers the risk of high blood pressure and high cholesterol. And don't forget moms, it can help to get your shape back sooner. We recommend rooming in where the baby will stay in the room with you so that you can learn your baby's needs and how to satisfy them. And the staff is available to help you with educational needs. Family members are welcome to visit and to celebrate the arrival of your new baby. We just ask that time be allowed each afternoon for mom and baby's rest. Infant security is very important to us, as well as to new parents. The maternity area is locked, so admission and exits will be provided by nursing staff. Staff in the maternity area have employee badges that are specific to the Women's Center. And baby and parents all have matching bracelets. In addition, babies are not allowed to be carried in the hall but rather pushed in their bassinet. WNJ offers a special care nursery if your infant requires additional short-term support after delivery. We are dedicated to providing you, your newborn, and family members with quality, compassionate care, and educational support. Breastfeeding classes are provided, as well as baby boot camp, to help prepare you for your upcoming arrival. Your baby will receive a hearing screening, PKU metabolic screening, cardiac screening, and a car seat screening for our smaller babies. We encourage you to share any personal requests with the nursing staff, such as cutting the cord or dad giving the first bath. 
Thank you for choosing WNJ as your hospital for delivering your baby. Please contact us anytime if you have additional questions. We look forward to seeing you.